For our next hands-on, we will look on the ADC and the DMA together. When the ADC last time, we use only the interrupt. This means after the ADC finished the conversion, it notify us with the interrupt and we was forced to read this value. But now we use the DMA. This means after the ADC reads the value, it asks the DMA to transfer this value for him into the, the memory automatically. On the end, we are still notified with the interrupt, but we are sure that this value it's was transferred automatically. Again, our famous QPMX, and we start the new project. Uh, Siri F4, uh, 401 line, and the package LQFP64 pin. And the device will be STM32F401REP. Okay, we have here our pinout. Like before, we will use almost the same configuration. We connect the PC13 and PA0 together to allow the, our ADC to read the, the button. Here I use the in zero, like before in the ADC. This is all from the pinout. In the clock configuration, I am okay with 60 megahertz. And here in the configuration, I need to configure the ADC a little bit differently. Then first of all in the parameters I'm okay with the clock settings in the resolution but not in the mode. Definitely I want to use the continuous mode. This means that the after I start the ADC it will convert the values all the time without stopping. This means the continuous mode. And also, because I want to use the DMA, I want to send the DMA request after each conversion. If you not use the continuous DMA request, the DMA stops after first uh, conversion cycle. In our case, after one, one conversion. Then I need to use the continuous DMA request. Here in the channel, again, I can set here for example, now a little bit different, or maybe this one, for example, sampling rate. And now I can need to configure the rest, then I can here configure the DMA. For this, I added this DMA request from the ADC, from the pay file to memory. The direction is okay. Definitely, I want to increase the memory address, for example, why not? The data width is half for it, it's okay. But here, because I want to conf uh, sample the values all the time, I need to use the circular mode to keep DMA running all the time. Okay, then this part is here okay. I can confirm it. I can store my project into here into my projects. And now, I, in this case, I will use the IR and I name it like the ADC and DMA, for example. I can store my project and I can generate generate my, my project for IDE. Okay, I can open my project in IR. Sorry, it will be in application, in my main. The configuration is almost same like before. Here is my ADC initialization. The DMA will be in the MSP package. You can find it here. It's very similar to the USART 
which we use uh, before. Now what we need to do is here start the ADC then again AHAL ADC underscore start and I will use it with uh, a DMA. The first parameter is again the handle and here with the DMA is more parameters and the second parameter is the buffer which I want to fill and the length of this buffer. Then I need to create for this reason my buffer. My ADC data buffer for one value. Okay, then I will use my ADC data. And I put it here and the size will be one. Now I can check if he can allow this because I think he has problem with the type because he expect the biggest type which is possible. Then I here need to retype. Retype it to the, ah, oh, sorry, 32 bit, 32 bit pointer. But even if I hear a typing to the 32 bit, he still use the configuration which is in the DMA, which is 16 bit. Okay, this part is okay. Now, this transfer for me automatically the data inside inside the memory. In case that I want to be notified um, in about the end of the conversion, I can use the callback. If not, I don't don't have to. But I for sure put here my callback again underscore underscore week. Not MSP in it, not MSP day in it, but definitely I need to use the conversion complete callback. Then I will return here, I put here my callback. But I don't need to put here anything because I don't need to run read this value manually. They are already read with the DMA. Here it's only for me for the notification. Then to allow me put here the breakpoint. I don't what I can put here. I can put here no operation. But I worry that my compiler will optimize this part. Then I here can change the optimization level none allow me to put here also the breakpoint to see if my code is running okay I can run my debug and we will see how this will work I can run it and I can put here my debug, you see, I getting the interrupt all the time. And I can here also check my values to add them into my watch. And if I put here the breakpoint, we can see the value. Is my value, ah, it's all right. You can see it's changing if I press the button, zero. Now it's, it's up, now it's down. And again, I can try this with my STM Studio to see it a little bit better. Then I close this one, I close the debug, and I can open again the STM Studio. I can again import my variables to search for my executable. At least you will see that I can use the different tool chains, not only the Eclipse based. The cube, the projects. And here it will be the ADC with the DMA. Here the executable will be with in the EVARM, in the DMA, and here in the executable. And here is dot out. I can import this. I can import my data zero on import again is here 
I can import into viewer and I can run. And now I forget to change the the maximum and the minimum. And I put here 4096 and you can see I still hear my value. If I press the button, it's, it is changing. Then it is working. You can try to do to watch the different values, which can be very good. But you can connect, for example, the signal generator in case you you have it. If not, I can here also recommend try to sample here the temperature sensor, which can be also very useful because the temperature sensor is inside the silicon of the STM32. Then, in case that you a little bit warm the STM32 up, the values will be also changing, but Please count the change of the temperature is not so big and on the on the values the change of the value in the IDC will be not so big. Okay, this is all from this this my example.